Hey, you two. Hey, uh, today uh, my refrigerator is not working. The water is not coming out from the dispenser. Okay? So, let's see. Click on water. I'm gonna put a cup in here. See, as you can see, there's no water coming out. And uh, last time, I fixed fixed the water not coming out because uh, the water line was uh, clogged or oh, from uh, frozen, it got froze. So I uh, heated up around here and everywhere. And after that, the water start coming out fine. But this time it's uh, different, okay? This time uh, I test it out and I check out my uh, my water filter in there. It works fine and everything. Then I went to the front panel and removed the cover. And then uh, I unplug this water connector, the quick connector, and the water is still not coming out from there. So I went to the back and then I test out the water in the valve. And uh, you had to check with the continuity. And after I checked it, uh, one of the valve went bad. So I'm gonna go ahead and then uh, order the parts. And I will, give you, I will give you guys an update. So please uh, stay tuned for the next video. Hey YouTube, welcome back. Hey, today I'm trying to troubleshoot my uh, refrigerator. The water is not coming out from the dispenser. And I checked the f filter is working fine. It's good. And I check on the connection right there. There's a quick connect. You could press a white tab to uh, unconnect the hose. And I test out from there, there's no water coming out. So I'm trying to find out the culprit. And then uh, I remove the inlet valve, the water inlet valve. And then I use my uh, digital multimeter to test out these uh, two connectors. Uh, you want to test it out to test out the continuity so you know if the water in the valve is working fine or not. So when I test out this uh, red connector, it was beeping for continuity so I know it's working. And then on the white one, it's not, there's no continuity so I know that water in the valve is bad. So I need to uh, Go ahead and purchase online on eBay to get that replaced so I will have uh, water coming up on my dispenser again. And another tips I want to go over with you is that uh, last time I did not connect, uh, clean my uh, water, I mean uh, air filter as you can see. It is a uh, whole bunch of dust over there. So lucky I opened it today so I'm going to go ahead and clean it out. Oh, see my uh, mess up my circuit board again. That's what happened last time. It went uh, overheated. So this is my uh, quick tips for you guys to check it out. Uh, why is your refrigerator water is not coming out? The first time I had was um, the freezer because the line is coming out from the freezer and then it got frozen. So the water, I had to use my uh, hair dryer to blow it out the, to melt it down the, the ice on the, the water line. So that's how I fixed it last time. But unfortunately this time I used the water in the valve and that's going to cost me around uh, $17 something with the free shipping. So it's uh, still cheaper than calling the repairman. Okay, so I'm gonna 
Hopefully you give a thumbs up and like this video and then uh, subscribe to our channel for any of the incoming new and latest video and uh, based on the tutorial guide you know all this uh, unboxing and if you got any uh, comment please uh, comment below if you got any questions and uh, thank you for watching and i'll see you on the next uh, video peace so I forgot to tell you guys, uh, you got, if you got a GE refrigerator, you need to uh, remove the two screw on the side. Left and right side with the Phillips screwdriver. And after that, you could, uh, after you uns unscrew those two screw, you could just uh, pop this uh, front uh, panel open. And it's holding by those uh, metal clips. So just give, give you guys an idea on how to remove the panel on the bottom of the front uh, panel. It's under the refrigerator uh, doors. So I purchased this uh, brush. So I could, uh, at the 99 cent store. So I could brush out that uh, nasty looking uh, dust around the fan. That's how the technician uh, cleaned it last time. I had to spend like 200 something, 280 to re get the board replaced. And then he he said that's the cost of it. So I need to clean it up first before my board goes bad again. Okay, thank you for sh uh, watching and then I'll see you on the next video. See, as you can see now, everything is so clean. Well, better than uh, before, okay? Nice and shiny. <sighs> On the side is still uh, lint. I'm gonna clean some more over there. So as you can see, I bend this uh, brush. So you go around the circular like that. So you keep on putting in and out and get all the dust out. Okay. So I have uh, put it back the my inner valve right now because it's, uh, I need to wait for the shipment to come in. So I ordered it on eBay already. So hopefully it comes soon so I get th get this uh, replaced. So stay tuned for the next uh, video. And then that's a back panel you have to remove. Whole bunch of screws around the back here. So I'll see you on the next video. Peace. Hey YouTube, I just got these parts today for my refrigerator. Uh, I have the GE. And this is uh, where I got it from. Made in China, super cool. Hmm. So let's go ahead and do the unboxing. Hopefully they uh, send me the right stuff. Because I'm pretty eager to fix my refrigerator today. So this is the parts. So the water line goes here. So I guess you gotta remove those the two clips for the quick release. I'm ready to go ahead and uh, install it. Before install, we gotta go ahead and unplug that. 
uh, just look at it, it seems like it's, it's water leaking. I will check out a little. The hose was getting old, let me check. So I did this old parts to match it up. This is an old one, this is a new one. Then I'm gonna use this uh, one quarter inch socket to remove the water in the valve. Make sure you uh, close the valve first, how's the water is going to score out. Get your plier ready. The old one is the new one. There are two different sizes. The white one is bigger. Goes here. The black one is smaller.
I'm gonna remove this uh, blue rings. Ouch. <clears throat> Remove those. You should pull it out. your screw I'm going to test it out, make sure the, the water doesn't leave before I put the back panel back. Hey, you do welcome back. And so as you know, uh, my refrigerator doesn't have water coming out from the water dispenser. So I have uh, replaced uh, my water in the valve. This is the old one. And then... Uh, Unfortunately, it did not work. Well, I know the inner valve was bad because I uh, I test out the continuity on the two valves. One was broken. So I know uh, that one has been fixed that I replaced the inner valve. And I uh, double check the water line and make sure it's not freeze up or anything. So that was a couple months back. So since I left it like that, it was broken. But the water <coughs> for the ice is coming through uh, slowly. So my last uh, solution is to replace a filter. I know this kind of filters are very expensive. It's about $45 for, just for this one. So I'm going to replace it and uh, hopefully that will solve the problem. So I'm going to go ahead and cut this open. So if you have a filter that's a long one, different than mine, then just go ahead and purchase that. So for my uh, refrigerator is uh, is this one the MV NWF So that's a water filter for GE appliance So please uh, stay tuned for the video and then uh, hopefully I will show you guys uh, the re resolution of the problem that I fix or not. Okay, thank you. And stay tuned for the next video. Okay guys, peace. So as you can see, that's the uh, old one that I have, the filter. And then uh, this is a new one.
I'm going to install it right now. So I do is just uh, twist, push, twist it counterclockwise. And then you just uh, put the new one in. Just uh, turn and twist. Okay, just like that. So right now I'm going to test out the water. Hold on, let me get a cup. Push the water. Ooh. Nice. So there you go. Problem has been fixed, guys. Okay. Thank you for watching. Please uh, ma make sure you guys uh, like this video and thumbs up. And subscribe to our channel for any of the upcoming videos of a tutorial or uh, anything like that. Unboxing or anything. Please uh, share this with your friend on social media on how to fix your refrigerator. Uh, the If the water is not dispensing due to a uh, freezer of the water line or uh, filter is dirty or your inner valve is going bad okay thank you for watching and i'll see you on the next uh, video peace out guys